Hey guys, what's up? So short video here today that I hope can be helpful to somebody because I could have used a video like this a while back. So when I first got into the racing style drone, I mean I've been flying drones now for about a year and, and I figured out you know, pretty quickly how easy it was to take on and off uh, the blades from a DJ, DJI style quad. It's super easy because everything on those quads is engineered to be super easy on a DJI drone and you don't even hardly have to think about it. They only go on one way and you just spin them on loosely. Uh, they're self-tightening as they run so you don't even have to worry about them falling off and it's super simple. Um, when you got in racing quads it's not that simple so I just assumed that it worked kind of the same way. Now this quad I knew that from just the screw, the bolts, the nuts on top that these aren't self-tightening so um, the nuts that it came with have the nylon lock inserts in them. So I got a prop and I put a prop on and you know it didn't have props on it when I got it. So I put the prop on and oh it's Mr. Biddy. Hello buddy. So I put the prop on and you know it slides on about that far and you guys can maybe see just about how far that slide on. I say okay so I put the screw on and I just assumed that it would slide down the shaft until it got so far and that's where it stopped and I would thread on the nut and tighten the nut up and put a little bit of a turn or two on there and I thought okay there it is so now <laughs> obviously if you know anything about quads that's totally wrong those that's not on the prop uh, was you know causing me tons of problems so I try to fly these and it worked fine until I hit the throttle very hard and it make crazy noises oscillation was absolutely horrible because the prop wasn't really on the shaft correctly so simple video now first off you got to put them on the right order I found tons of information that stuff's easy to find you can find all the information you need about you know the the way they spin uh, but I'll just review that really quick so on your drone on your quad Motors are always turning towards the quad. That's the way, the easiest way to remember. So, always turning towards. This one's counterclockwise, this one's clockwise. That's a normal setup. Turn it around, always turning towards the quad, whether it's front or back. So, hello, Mr. Biddy. Oh, always turning towards the quad. Okay. So, if you have one like this, you've got motors that uh, have arrows on them that tell you which way to go so that makes it just a little bit easier to tell you which way the motor spins but when you put the blades on there's no difference um, bit way that they thread on either side but there is a difference in the blade shape so you got to look at the blade shape so they're always pushing air downward so the blade shape needs to be ramped upwards the direction that it's turning so that blade will go on that way we gotta pause this video so I can pet Mr. Biddy okay guys so you want to make sure that you put the props up in the right direction the writing will be the writing you'll see up facing up to you and they're always going to be ramped towards the inside of the drone so these props have been on now that I learned how to put the props on correctly they slide all the way down so that's the key they slide all the way down the shaft Mr. Biddy's making this off hard for me alright so this one's this way this one is over here and this one is over here alright so they're gonna go all the way down the shaft because the top of your motor bells turn with the shaft so it doesn't matter <laughs> every time I try to make a video Mr. Biddy it's like he'll it's like it's like this is crazy but okay but here's the thing like I mean he doesn't even hardly want to have anything to do with me most of the time you know I mean he's not, he, he's not he, we're friends Mr. B is my friend you know but it's not like we're best friends or anything you know but as soon as I start making a video he's just like Man, he's just got to be all over. He's got to be. In. I think he just wants to be on camera. Like, anytime I'm making a video, it's just he jumps in. All right, so check that out. Look at that. That prop, it's all the way down flush with the bottom of the motor. When you do that, you don't have to worry about it. So, 
So if I could have found this video, I looked online a bunch. I mean, I looked all over and I could not find any information about how to put props on. I mean, I could find out the order that they went in, you know, and all that stuff, like clockwise, counterclockwise, and the direction the prop went. But what I couldn't figure out is like, how do you physically attach them to the plane? Like, and it just they just go all the way down. When you first, when you first put on a prop, it doesn't want to go all the way down the shaft. You got to literally just push it, force it down the shaft, and you have to kind of maybe thread it a little bit. Now, after they've been on and off, they'll slide right up and down. And uh, yeah, so hey, all the way down, tighten the nut pretty tight. I mean, it's going to tight it till it doesn't tighten anymore, all right? Hey, and uh, <laughs> look at Mr. Vinny just wants to he just wants to be in every video, all right? So, hey, from me, FPV Matt, and uh from Mr. Vinny, have a great day. <laughs>